What's up, guys, and welcome back to another hardcore episode. Um, our little um, here. Let me uh, let me hop on uh, Oreo here. Get my lead back. Thank you very much. Let's we'll ride him on over. Um, the uh, the sugarcane farm is doing great. Stay there. Don't go anywhere. Uh, the last few here are much longer because I've decided. You know what? Going with the six design, I need four blocks in between to make sure the redstone doesn't touch on either side. Um, it was just more beneficial for me to go and make it uh, a longer, longer versions instead of doing these small little six ones. It's doing all right. Um, I've only been uh, AFKing. I don't know for maybe about a. I don't want to say a half hour, maybe an hour or so, something like that. Um, just going around doing random maintenance and stuff like that. I went mining for uh, for a while. Went and repaired some of my stuff in the nether, and um, yeah, so just uh, just doing simple maintenance stuff. Some people were, were telling me that I should put in a hopper system down here, and uh, I more than likely will, um, but it'll be something real simple. It looks like uh, one of them died. There we go, and um, you know, we'll have... Uh, These guys, uh, there we go. Drop their goodies and stuff inside of a chest instead. Um, but for now, I think this is fine because, uh, wow, just that right there, bro. He had a, he seemed to have a lot more health than the other guys. Um, I, I, I literally have too much iron that I know what to do with at the moment. In fact, I don't even care enough to bring that back to the house and um, put it away anywhere. So um, we'll, we'll do something with that, something in the future. Maybe I'll do a build and I'll have like the whole floor be like iron blocks. Um, I think eventually I could probably do that. Look at this guy over here trying to get at my villagers. They, they, that's all they have to say about that. It's just, huh, hmm, hmm. But um, yeah, I think uh, the next step is uh, is for us to maybe look for a witch. Uh, we don't have many swamps, and unfortunately, taking a horse into the swamps is kind of a difficult task to do because they do not um, um, swim very well unless it's just one deep. So uh, anything more than that is. Um, they just sink, and I gotta push them or pull them with a lead um, through the water. I don't, uh, off the top of my head, know or if we've seen a witch hut. I don't think we have in hardcore. Uh, I'm pretty sure we found one in our SMP series. Sometimes I get those two experiences mixed up when they're far behind, um, like earlier hardcore episodes to um, earlier SMP episodes. I'm not sure which one we found and what, and what we haven't. Um, but yeah, uh, other than doing the, uh, the sugarcane thing I, I, and mining a bit, um, I did mine actually quite a bit. Uh, I was watching the Rooster Teeth podcast and, um, catching up with some, uh, I guess clerical stuff, you could say. Um, things that I don't really need to pay full attention to, so I can, or, well, vice versa, I can mine mindlessly. And um, and get work done. In fact, let's uh, let's actually take some more of these. I've already taken a couple over here, and we'll grab our speed potions too. We'll figure something to do. I hear a skeleton somewhere. They're usually on these ledges here. Um, we can either go find a uh, a witch, or we can. Um, Get to work on making something pretty in the nether. Our nether looks like poop, and the base there is just terrible. And um, I think it would be nice to have uh, some. I'll take two because these don't last that long. Uh, it'd be nice to have uh, some uh, a base in the nether, so when we go there, we're not, uh, you know, we're not just taking a, a small little train down uh, down below. But um. I don't know. I, I sort of want to go on an adventure, but the thing is, I did that last or two episodes, t technically two episodes ago, and it turned out like crap. I didn't find anything. I found one little village that was really 
small and insignificant. And um, these fellas here, um, do I have a golden apple? It's either a golden apple or a golden carrot, yeah? Maybe we should take uh, Oreo back here, back to the stables by the stronghold, and um, see what sort of new horse we can get. Uh, I don't know how much gold I have over there, but I know I have a couple here. So let's do this. We'll get some golden nuggets, and um, carrots are down below. Be a good use of our carrots, too, because uh, I don't use these for anything. And I think it's just this, yeah? Yeah. All right. So we got five, which is, um, which is funny. I'll take these carrots with me because we can use them at the other base. So I'm going to ride Oreo over there, and I will see you guys in a second. All right. So we made it back to our, uh, our awesome stronghold here. And, oh, excuse me. We're going to uh, get, uh, let's see. You have uh, one extra heart. And you have three extra hearts. Interesting. Maybe we should take um, take these two right here and uh, and breed them because they have a lot of health. Uh, I can't remember how fast they are though. Because uh, the whole point of having a horse is fast travel, yeah. Um, so we know how fast uh, Oreo is. I guess uh, I c I probably could have bought more um more uh saddles over I got to get a different solution than those uh those ones right there Yeah, he's okay. He's kind he's kind of quick. He's got some pep. Just uh get off from here. Do one of these. Take the saddle off. What about you? Oh, you are you are quicker. That's for sure. But just a little bit quicker. Interesting. Okay, so let's uh let's get these two horses uh right here. Put you and you. And there we go. We got another little spotted one. Hello, yes. Um, I have carrots. No, you don't like carrots. Okay. Do you like carrots? Oh, I can't can't feed them carrots anymore. Do I gotta shift click them? No. I didn't know that shift clicking though opens up that inventory. That's pretty neat. I thought it was only when um you had uh actually you know what I did it earlier and I I, I never noticed. Interesting. So we can keep these open. And uh, we'll bring Oreo out too. Why not? All right. I got to put a saddle on you. There we go. And we'll untie this fella. Can I tie? Oh, you got to tie an entity first. Okay. So we got our little um, baby horse here. Uh, I think they probably take probably about 20 minutes. Just like... Um, uh, actual horse or other animals and stuff do. In fact, do we have uh, a chest? Where is our? There it is. I'll put two of them down. Um, oh, and by the way, I'm using um, Faithful right now as a texture pack. 32-bit uh, Faithful. Because uh, I, I don't know, I just like the way it looks. It's just an, uh, a higher res version of default Minecraft. Uh, I, I really do enjoy it. Um, I think it's a it's a great texture pack. And uh, either these need to go down or my headset. I don't know. Either or. A lot of cows making noises. And um, it's getting pretty loud. There we go. Now, um, I, I still haven't decided yet on what we're going to be doing this episode, aside from just the little things that I'm doing now. Um, hello, cows. Make more beautiful cows for me, thank you. It needs your leather. 
Come on. Did I get all of you? I think I did. So we'll let them handle that, and then we'll come in here, and we're gonna have to start uh, start taking some of them out because they're they're just pushing each other around right now. That is not uh, not good cow etiquette. And I, th I think the baby ones can go through those, so I'm gonna try to keep it closed. Where's the baby? Okay, it's hanging out in the stables. All right, now what to do? Hmm. So many, so many things, but exploring is going to take a very long time. Building something is going to take a very long time, and I still have to edit the SMP for today. Hmm. Let me take a quick break, just so I can get my bearings straight. So I'm not just sitting here recording myself thinking uh, out loud. On, uh, on what to do. Yes, yes, that's a good idea. All right, well, you know what? This episode seems to be about horses so far, so how about we do some horsey stuff and uh, not horse around or nothing like that. No, we gotta get work done. Let's make a stable, but over at uh, the old home or our current home, I don't know. I, I, I think that's still my current home over there. So we're gonna take Oreo because I don't wanna take uh, either one of the parents away from their a baby horse. Baby horses, fawns, fowls. What? No, is that uh? This is a name for a baby horse. Yeah, it's not pony. Ponies are different types of horses, aren't they? Like a pony is like a pony is not a horse type of deal. Am I mixing this all up? I don't know. Shimmy and and Jessica, you you two like horses. What 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 am I trying to say here? One of you, one of you will fix will will correct what I'm saying. Um. If not, then well, whatever. It's just it is what it is. I'm 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 telling everybody false information again. But what else is new? Let's go kill this zombie. Yeah. Whoa, he's got a sword. You know, zombies love spawning in this area. I fought a bunch last time uh, I was out over this way. It's not very nice. I'd shoot you with arrows too, and miss a bunch. You know what? I'm just whoa wasting arrows at this point. Oh, we got a bunch of zombies coming. Jump it! Oh, come on! There you go. Maybe uh maybe I should do something about this spawner too. Pretty soon. I know we went in here before, but what is this for? Spiders. Okay, I've, I the last time I made a spider spawner was very basic. Um, or a spider trap, I guess. Uh, so. Maybe that's something to look into. If you guys know anybody that made a, a really cool spider trap, let me know. And um, I'll go check them out. I don't think I've ever filmed anything in an abandoned mine either in this hardcore yet. There's one over there, but um, all I did, was, that was when I was looking for melon seeds. And uh, after I found some, I just said, you know what? Nope, I'm done. Also, what's that... Uh, What's this over here? The cobblestone tower. What is that indicating again? I forgot. Let's go. Let's let's. We haven't really done ever anything in the night, so let's uh let's keep rolling this night episode. Maybe uh maybe this will just be me cruising around at night, fighting baddies and exploring what's actually around the base here. Man, there's a lot of bad things over here. Look at all this. That's crazy! Alright, what is this? Oh, is that one of those the mob spawners I found? Ooh. We are probably going to get attacked here, but that's fine. Oreo will be alright. Me, on the other hand. Ooh, I don't know. I really should start labeling these things. Alright, come on. Let's go. Hmm, how far out have we gone this way, this direction? I don't know if we have or not. Hmm, is that a swamp? It is a swamp. Okay, well, since uh, we wanted to look for witches, why don't we go check out this swamp real quick? 
Let's see if we can't find a witch hut, because if there's one this close, then, oh man. We are going to luck out. Get away from me, spiders. Okay, it is a swamp. Uh, map is not loading as quick as I would like it to do. But, I can blame that on the recording. Oh man, water. Jump! Okay. Come on. Okay, wait, I'm just gonna hang out over here real quick. Next time, make sure I have leads on my hot bar. Okay, come on. Pull you out of the water. I don't know why I st still have so many seeds on me. Come on, get up. All right. Just cruising around, trying to mind our own business. Lots of creepers. It's actually a pretty decent swamp. Maybe I should make it my objective to build a like um, a villager village in every biome. I think that'd be kind of fun. It's always been sort of a a, a weird objective of mine. Every now and then, we'll we'll toss out if I'm looking for something to do is to build or have a build, some sort of build in every biome. I'm not seeing a witch hut here. Let's go into the desert where we can actually see some stuff. I do like the fact that I could ride around with a charged bow and not lose any speed. That's pretty cool. I think I hit the back of my horse on that one. Um, Alright, so yeah, ho taking a horse for witch hunting is, is kind of a difficult thing to do. Because swamps are just full of water and, well, that's tough for a horse to, to go over. Doing it at night, I guess, is probably not a smart idea either, but, you know, whatever. Like I said, I don't, I, I'm not sure if we've had a night episode since the very beginning, you know? All right, you can go in these waters. That's fine. Hmm. It'd be cool if you could breed a horse to the point where he's, like, he's strong enough to be able to swim and stuff. And stuff. And stuff. Hmm. Not seeing anything. Got a lot of mobs though. The big old slime. Bam. Go through these trees. We'll be fine. I do like that. <laughs> I do like that you're able to go through trees and stuff like that and not just suffocate the entire time. I'm glad that uh, they thought of that. Or if they didn't think of that, I'm glad it worked out to be like that. I thought you could shoot lily pads. Guess not. Mm -hmm. Got that sand temple thing over there. Hmm. Well, darn it. It looks like we've kind of explored this whole swamp unless there's more over here Ooh, calm down mr. creeper all is well yeah darn it hmm well um, that was a disappointment uh, let's just uh, let's just go traveling I mean we're already out I know this started off as like a horse episode and I'm like, okay, let's build a stable. But then I came home and well, these things happen. Oh man, I gotta get better at doing that. You got a bunch of Endermen up here. Came really close to going off the edge there. We're still fine. We're still doing good. I don't like the, the looks of that though. So we're gonna go over here. And just slowly go down. There we go. Maybe third person would be better. Oh, the sun's coming out, so 
That's something. Go through the desert. Anything aside from the snow biome, I am I am more than happy to be in. Because we have been in snow biomes for way too long in this series, and uh, it's just it's too much. There's other biomes out there, Mojang. All right. Why isn't there a, a huge desert that seems like you you can never get out of it? That's one thing I'm very excited for in 1.7. However, we're pretty much screwed in that uh, aspect because our map is already generated and uh, we're not going to get any of the new biomes unless there's a way for them to rework the, the, the biomes without destroying anything. And uh, here we are at a snow biome. Which we are not going to go into. Not ever. Not even for a second to be like, okay, I'll just cross through it real quick. Because it doesn't happen. You go into it and you're always in it. Dislike snow biomes. I used to love them. When they were new and fancy, I, yeah, I loved them. They were great. Now I despise them. Until every other biome is just as big as snow ones. Then it'll be like, okay, well, I don't really have a choice anymore. It's either snow biome or bus. Look at that. It curves all the way around into this. Whee! Ow. Hmm. Okay, so I'm, I'm pretty sure this episode has probably already reached 20 minutes at least. It had to have. Oh, man. Really was sort of hoping that there'd be more to this episode, but guys, this is just how it's gonna be some de some episodes. Huh. Oh, okay, there we go. I think um, I think it is possible though. Um, just spitballing here. I'm not gonna say that it is fact that uh, we may fight the Ender Dragon at episode 50. Just maybe. Um, seeing as how we have the Blaze Farm up, it isn't as efficient as I thought it would be and I think that's just because I'm basing my um, expectations of it on regular mob traps where there are, all other mobs are affected by gravity I, well you know aside from like chickens and um, I think just chickens and blaze and ender dragon those are the only three flat bats too but um other ones is it gonna rain yeah it's raining um, I was gonna say, how is it raining over there? But I realize it's grass right here. And look at that snow biome; it curved all the way around over here. It's terrible. Um, I'm used to other mob traps where where mobs are affected by gravity, so they they come down and they they plump down, you know, and they're just ready to roll. I'm pretty sure that's the uh, by the the swamp we just checked. Um. So it's not as efficient that way, but blaze they, they take a little bit to come down and into the into the small little hole that we've dedicated for them. Oh sweet. So um that's why I feel like it's it's less efficient. This is the first blaze farm I've ever made, so I just assume that um I don't know. I assumed it would be better. But it is better. That's the thing. I assumed it'd be better, but it is better. Um You definitely get um, experience much quicker with the blaze farm. Just looked like it would be like for a mob or like a mob spawner would be in there or something. But uh, yeah, I, I've been getting a couple of good enchants on books and stuff like that. So I think pretty soon we'll have a uh, a pretty good set of armor and. Um, Hopefully a pretty badass bow. I'm, I'm, pr I'm pretty happy with this one currently. Power 4 is pretty sweet. Um, I'd like a little bit more punch or um, infinite would be great. I haven't gotten that enchant yet. So, um, I don't know. I'll plug away. Maybe I'll AFK in it as I'm editing this. And um, editing the SMP as well. So, uh, you know, we can try to get some uh, some good gear soon. So, uh, yeah, that'll be a good episode 50, I think. And seriously, this snow biome is, is following us, guys. I think um, I should I should get one of those uh, those render programs and render out my map just so I can look at, like, how crazy these snow biomes are of what we've explored and what we haven't. Um, 
I, I've tried to stick away from those because I don't want to really ruin the map for me. You know, I don't want to know where things are. I like exploring and finding stuff, but I don't like episodes where I'm exploring and nothing's happening. So it's sort of a catch-22. Uh, hmm. Oh, right. Rain. Forgot about that. Forgot it was raining. Is it crazy clowns here? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I guess speaking of 1.7... I really don't want to end this map until I die, obviously, but, um, man, I really want to, to check out the new biomes and how they're supposed to be pretty, yeah, uh, pretty slick. And here it is. It's still over here. What is going on over there? Got, like, smooth stone. Hold on, let's pop off here for a second. So we have a lava pool up there. And then a cave system underneath it? That's a short one, though. Still, that's a little weird. I hope Oreo doesn't go into the lava. Yeah, this is awkward. It's like smooth stone up in the tree. Hmm. Okay, let's get back to riding. Oh, cool, another swamp. Nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we gotta get out of there. That's dangerous. Why Why is this happening? Okay, back to 1.7, though. Uh, maybe, just maybe, once it comes out, maybe we move to some chunks that haven't loaded yet. You know, that way we still keep the world and everything, but... um. We get to enjoy the new biomes. I don't know. That's just my thought. Uh, that being said, though, I really don't want to move all of my stuff. Because <laughs> it would take a long time. And since we've worked in that area for so long, too, we basically lose out on all of our awesome stuff. And we don't have warps, so... Oh, wow. Whoa! Got two little baby villagers. Don't, don't the, uh, doesn't the witch spawn those guys? What the witch, uh, spawns little babies? I'm not seeing a hut. Let's see if we can't traverse over here. Oh! Okay, I did not know that you could ride him in too deep water. I thought that was actually impossible, but alright. So yeah, still no hut, and I'm, I'm without even looking at the time, I know that this has been a long episode, so guys, I'm going to let you go. Uh, thanks for watching my video. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I do appreciate it. Uh, if not, maybe leave some uh, constructive comments, or again, if you guys have a spider uh, trap, let me know, because I am interested in building one. We have a couple that are sort of close to the spawn, or um, not spawn, but, uh, you know, our house. So, um... It'd be nice to be able to utilize that, even though I can't really think of anything aside from wool that we'll need string for. Um, still, you know, it's it's good experience to, to, to make them. And I'm going to keep looking for a witch for a little while. Yeah, or maybe I should head home. It's a long ways home. And we're still surrounded by a snow bomb. Yeah, I'm just going to head home. So, I will see you guys for the next episode, which will be tomorrow. Which hopefully I have a game plan before I start recording. That would be a, probably be a good idea. And I, uh, I will see you guys later.